This is Cryfontein Metro Rail Station in the Western Cape. Long queues can be seen seeping out of the station building as commuters rush to catch the early train. About 1,400 people travel from here to Cape Town CBD. But thousands more rely on this mode of transport throughout the province despite the many issues they face. Eyewitness News took a ride on the Northern Line, which is currently the city's busiest because the Central Line has been closed since 2019, to see what it's like to be on a public train. Pauline Chinakizwa is rushing to catch train number 2500 with her two children in hand. They manage to board, but she counts this time lucky. Chinakizwa takes the train from Cryfontein and drops her children off at school in Kensington. She then gets back on the train to Cape Town where she works. This is their daily trip. Chinakizwa feels bad for having to wake up her kids so early, especially since full-time learning has been reinstated. Other issues of concern that Chinakizwa faces are train delays and safety. With COVID-19 lockdown regulations eased, more people are taking the trains. Chinakizwa wishes for more security guards to be present. Prasa said their trains cut through the heart of settlements, which is why it made them so accessible to the majority and still remained the most affordable mode of transportation. Commuter Daniel Alcoster spends 100 rand on trains weekly. He said this was half the expenses he would have spent if he took taxis. Other commuters like Casey Saladon agree. But with many stations not being operational, most commuters end up being an hour or more late to their destinations. Saladon must take a taxi to Stetland Station because the Kales River Station is not working. Prasa is currently fixing rail infrastructure and upgrading some of its stations as part of their National Station Improvement Program. New trains are also said to be deployed soon. With plans of new trains and upgraded stations in place, Commuters hope that this will make their daily trips safer and with less delays.